Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to our favorite show. My name's Angelina and on today's episode, I'm going to be showing you what's in my wallet. Um, I've seen these videos and for some odd reason, I really enjoy watching them. Um, I think everyone deep down has like a snoopy side and a nosy side and just wants to know what people have. Um, so I thought it'd be cool if I showed you what's in mine. If you do like these videos and you like being a snoop like I do, um, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up letting me know you do. Also, if you're not subscribed already, make sure you hit the subscribe button also because I do upload two times a week and that's two times you can snoop on me. <laughs> so this is my wallet. Hopefully I'm not glaring you with my lights. Um, let me know if you do like this lighting. It is different to, the, to my last video. Um, so let me know in the comments down below if this is an improvement. Um, it's my first time using them, so let me know. But anywho, my wallet is Oriton. I got it about, it's an old wallet now. I got it about two years ago, I wanna say. Um, I absolutely love it. Um, I've wanted to get a new Oriton wallet though uh, for a couple months now, but every time I go into the store, the wallets are just not what I like. This one here fully opens up, and I don't like the ones that are just like, you get them, and they're just like this, and you don't know what's in your wallet, and you gotta like scramble. I really don't like those wallets. I prefer when they open all the way like this, um, and you can fold it as well. Um, it's pretty versatile to be honest and that's why I love it but for some reason I hadn't seen them making it and it's really annoying <laughs> but let's get into what I have this is where I keep my main cards so let me show you these ones the most important card is obviously my debit card where um, it holds all my money so pretty much my bank card where I buy things with Boom. I'm not going to take that one out because, yeah, it's got my account details. <laughs> Next um, is my photo card. So my Australian approved ID. Um, usually people would have like a driver's license and they would have their photo on that. But I don't drive. I don't have my driver's license. So I needed a photo card instead so I could go to places. So that's the photo card. Next I have my Mecca Maxima card. It has to be in the important section of course. Um, that's just my members card there. Then I don't know why I still have this in my in my wallet but it's my TAFE. It's my TAFE card. Um, I did go to TAFE in 2013 and now it's 2016 so three years ago. And I don't know why I have it in here. Just odd. Um, I need to get rid of it. <laughs> um, next, I have my Medicare card. So, like, my healthcare card. Boom. Then I just have, like, my workers card. So, uh, I have a part-time retail job. And this is just my superannuation card. So, when I retire, I've got money in the bank. <laughs> then going on to this like pocket section here, um, in this first pocket I have my Opal card. This is a transport card um, where instead of going to the bus driver or going to the train station and saying I want to go to the city or just anywhere really, you simply just tap it on the machine and it like beeps and then when you get off you tap it and it beeps again and it measures how much money that they should take from you. Um, you save more money with the Opal card rather than buying a transport ticket. So it's kind of handy to have. You just got to make sure you have money on it. Otherwise you can't use it. So that's my Opal card. Since I don't drive I need. And then I like to call this my junk pile. I think everyone has a junk pile in their wallets. Um, or they just chuck like receipts and whatnot. Um, and this is mine. Michael and I love going to Krispy Kreme to get a coffee or a milkshake or even a donut. So I have my coffee cards and my milkshake cards here. When you get 
When you buy five coffees in a row, you get the sixth one for free plus a donut. And believe it or not, it's not hard for Michael and I to get um, a free coffee. It's just we do that so fast. Then I just got a bunch of receipts that I can't even read anymore. The, a bunch of bus tickets, um, the Leagues Club, more bus tickets, uh, some receipts. Oof, I went to the cinemas. What did I watch? Oh, I watched Terminator. Um, go on a Tuesday to the movies because they're only half price. I paid $12 and every other day it's like $24. So make sure you go on a Tuesday because it's just crazy expensive. Then I just have a bunch of receipts and just nothing to really go through. I can't even read half of these receipts to be honest. And then in the coin section I obviously have coins but um, I carry my house key in there because I don't drive, I don't have like a big bundle of keys. Um, so I just put all my keys in here because I always have my wallet on me. So yeah, that's where I get my keys if you're wondering. <laughs> Moving on to this section here, I guess the less important section. Um, we obviously see Michael there. This is a picture of him when he was, I think like 10, 12-ish. Um, so when he was a little baby. Uh, I saw this in his house and I didn't have anything here in my wallet. So I'm like, give it to me now, and I just popped it in my wallet. Um, so yeah, that's him. I have two little cash pockets, um, and I do, and I am carrying cash on me right now. Um, I don't like carrying cash because I'm scared that I'll drop it somewhere or misplace it, and that's not fun losing money. But for some reason, I have cash on me, and to be specific, it's $95. Um, I like Australian money. Australian money is good because, I don't know, it's colourful so you know what's what, you don't really need to look too hard. But I guess once you live in a country for a while you just know. So yeah, that's Australian money if you're wondering. Then moving on to these cards. This top one I have, this bright green one, is my credit card from my bank. Um, I try not to use this too much but it's very, very tempting. Then down here I have two Leagues Clubs cards. Gosh, try saying that three times fast. Um, I've just got two of those. Then I have a loyalty card for Review. I love the clothing store Review. It's so, so nice, the clothes. Um, another store I love is Bonds. Hence I have the card. Bonds have the best comfy clothing. Oh, so good. Then down here, not quite sure why I have this one. I have a Napoleon Rewards card. Um, I'm not a fan of Napoleon too much. I haven't tried it really, but what I have tried, not a fan. Um, then I just got my work discount card. Always good to have. Then down here behind Michael, I just have all these uh, business cards. They're like doctors, um, some more loyalty cards. Um, and just boring stuff that you don't really use too often, but are good to have. So that's my messy wallet. Uh, when I was a kid, I never thought I would fill like all these slots with cards, but look at me now. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did like snooping on my wallet, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, letting me know you did. Um, also, if you know of any stores that have similar wallets like this, I would love to love to know so leave me that comment down below letting me know i will love you forever so like subscribe comments and i'll see you guys very very soon bye